Yeah, my name is Edward Manoli II, and I'm from Oahu originally, now reside in uh, Kailua, Kona, Hawaii. I was married uh, right out of high school, uh, my high school sweetheart, which didn't pan out as we planned, but I have uh, two boys uh, with her. And then I met Paris. She was from the same school that we went to, and um, she was one of those, uh, I guess, trophies when, when guys look at you know, women's girls or whatever. I always thought that I wasn't good enough to, to date her. As we got older and worked together, I saw an opportunity to go ahead and ask her, and she said yes, and we decided to date and eventually get married. And then we had uh, three kids. Paris was very outgoing, and um, I love that. I love that trait. I'm, I'm with her for 20, 28 years. So being that that's something that I didn't have as a trait, I fed off of what she had. How we met Kevin is Paris was a steward for her union. So she told me about uh, the life insurance and you know we were getting up there in age and we decided that it's something that we need to look into. So basically she contacted uh, Kevin and he came over here and put together a plan and we talked about it. You know, people don't care how much you know until they know how much you care, right? And for me, I wear my heart on my sleeve. And so I think Ed saw that and opened up and you know, we were just jiving and it's like we're, we were, you know, we were very friendly and open to talk. Um, so Paris, so in 2000, she had, uh, she found a lump in her breast. So Paris was kind of like a clutch, like she's clumsy. If there's a hole in the pavement, she'll find it. If there's a hole in the, in the ground, she'll find it and she'll fall. She, she's just that type of person. So she falls one day uh, in our front yard and um, we're joking, we're laughing because the type of person she is and asked her if she was okay, she said yes. Picked her up, brought her in the house and she says she can't feel the legs. And basically, uh, the cancer had spread throughout her spine. They did a procedure on her spine. No sooner Paris is uh, in the room, and she's like, I'm gonna get up and walk. I'm like, you just got out of surgery. There's no way you're gonna do that. So one of the doctors looks at her and goes, can you dance a hula? She ended up dancing a hula. You know, and uh, everybody, in that uh, nursing station was amazed. They, everybody just cried. We were home for maybe about four days. And I remember the day that she passed. And she told me, you know, the typical, I love you, goodbye. But That, that goodbye was from the So after losing Paris, for some reason the light bulb goes off. Goes, oh, I remember I had a life insurance. I'm over in Honolulu with no life insurance paperwork in front of me. I started searching through my phone looking for Kevin's number. To get that call, suddenly it's like, wait, what? It was just a shocker for me, you know, that you know someone so young was so full of aloha, you know, and was was taken from you know from all of us. And I was like, don't worry, Ed, relax. It's, it's gonna be fine. Just get a piece of paper and pen, and let me tell you what needs to get done. It was just like a domino effect. One thing just led to another, to, led to another, but successfully. Not it, there weren't any roadblocks or any delays. It just made my life easier that I didn't have to think, basically. Well, I needed to do this, I needed to do that. It was all taken care of. Undoubtedly, uh, American Income Life AO has 
totally went above and beyond their standards as far as the insurance goes. And from my experience, my experiences with, with the company, it's got my approval 100%. Paris had bought a ring, a wedding ring. You know what she told me? It's for your next wife. And I was just like, what are you talking about? And that's the ring that I proposed to the Storm. She's amazing. And uh, my family tells me that I'm lucky because I get to love twice, the same type of love. Never stop loving. Never stop loving. Love what you do. Love what you hate. You still love it.